Good evening, everyone. Meteorologist Mark Thibodeau here. Well, we now have our ninth tropical uh, system of the season in the Caribbean. Tropical Storm Ian, named by the National Hurricane Center here at the 11 p.m. advisory. Winds are now 40 miles an hour. Still a uh, low-grade tropical storm moving west-northwest at 12 miles an hour. Pressure 1,005 millibars. 385 miles southeast of Kingston, Jamaica. This is going to intensify as we go through the weekend. We could very well be dealing with a, a significant hurricane moving into the southeastern Gulf of Mexico as we head into early next week through the weekend as it ramps up under ideal conditions at the upper levels and the surface. Good evening, everybody. Welcome back to another video. I'm going to make this real quick. It is Tuesday, September 27th, 2022, the day before Hurricane Ian makes landfall on the south uh, southwest side of Florida. I'm up in Tampa, uh, so I'm north of where the landfall is supposed to take place. But we were told we're still going to have 16 to 18 hours of, her, of uh, uh, tropical storm winds and tropical storm conditions. And possibly in some of those thunderstorms or storms, uh, we can have some hurricane gusts. But I'm, you know, just hanging out here in my apartment the night before. And we're just kind of waiting on the storm. It's kind of a, you know, nice, it was nice evening. It was cloudy earlier, uh, but it's starting to clear out. But to our south, uh, some of the rain is uh, starting to push through. So I just wanted to make a quick update the day before. Um, and I'll probably just meet up with y'all uh, tomorrow once, you know, things start to kind of happen. This is the sunset before the storm. Turn this way and that's looking south. Um, and that weather is going to start heading this way and then more, you know, to our, uh, to our southeast. Um, but yeah, we'll get some tropical storm conditions here, maybe a, a hurricane gust here and there. Uh, but it's a very nice evening tonight. The calm before the storm. It's kind of hard to see, so I don't know if you'll be able to see it on the camera, but it's raining now. It's 7 a.m. Uh, Wednesday, September 28th, 2022. Hurricane Ian is still uh, offshore, but it is getting ready to come ashore near the... Uh, a little bit north of Fort Myers, like the Port Charlotte area, uh, kind of where Hurricane Charlie made landfall in 2004. Um, but yeah, it's raining right now. I've been up since about 6.30, and that's kind of when it started. So it's been raining for about half an hour. I don't know if it's going to show, but you can see those white clouds are moving left to right. Um, a lot of the stronger stuff is still south of us, but I think some of these, uh, the outer, outer bands already are coming through, but I think these are some of just the outer bands. Uh, so the weather might pick up a little bit here in the next few hours. Uh, but I just wanted to show you, you can see the clouds moving. It's kind of crazy. Again, it's going to be hard to see because of the screen, but we are starting to get a little bit uh, more wind, but it's still nothing crazy. But just wanted to give you guys an update. Just after 3 o'clock on Wednesday, September 28th, 2022, and Hurricane Ian has made landfall. It is 312 right now. It is still way south of here, 
So we're just getting outer, outer bands um, and some heavy, you know, not heavy winds, but some of the gusts are pretty strong. I'm sorry again for the screen, you can't really see much. Uh, but yeah, we're just, you know, nothing too, too crazy happening. But I just wanted to give a timestamp for uh, when this hurricane made landfall.
hard to see through the screen, but it's the first bit of blue sky in a few days. Uh, Hurricane Ian made landfall yesterday at about 3 o'clock as a Category 4 strengthening uh, to a Category 5, but just did not make it. Um, so this is the day after, and it's just a little breezy now, but like I said, there's blue sky starting to come through, and it is just... It is 12.56 right now, so we got some blue skies.